Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 48, and this is war number four. And we're going up against an alliance called Furia Roja. All right, let's see, who did they ban? Ooh, Bishop, Iceman, <laughs> and um, Sunspot. Okay, Kingpin Global. And Hercules is immune. All right, let's take a look and see what we got going on here. Ooh, I don't see future Ant-Man over there, so that's interesting. But here's future Ant-Man on this node. Well, well, well. Now, I could bring in Gallon. However, Gallon will take about three specials to get him down. Or I can bring in Hulkling, who should be able to handle uh, him just fine and can probably handle um, Doom as well. So let's put a pin in that. We got Hulkling. All right, now for this one, we kind of want someone who is a uh, bleed immune, if we can. So, hmm. Could do, um, ugh. Bleed immune, bleed immune. I mean, Corvus could do Corvus. Yeah, that's a possibility. Could do Corvus. <clears throat> Trying to think who else. Um, Cosmic Ghost Rider can also do that one. I might try Cosmic Ghost Rider. I don't think I've brought him in um, for this fight before. You know... Although Corvus is immune to the, uh, or it doesn't take damage from the shock in case I get shocked, but yeah, we might try, um, <clears throat> we might try that. Now this one here, now we've taken Super Scroll, but if you remember, we use Bishop, who is banned right now. So this is going to be interesting. I'm going to need to find someone, um, <clears throat> that can handle that. And I have to use one of the uh, attackers, um, Ex Magica. Ugh. And even if I brought in, like, say I brought in um, Claire, she can nullify, but the way that that RNG works, I'm going to get shocked. Before I can nullify his uh, armor ups, I'll get shocked. And take a lot of damage. So I'll need to, once again, look at my Ex Magica. Let's see here. And I kind of want to take this bishop here. So I really want to bring in... Um, oh. Hmm. Interesting. But I want to bring in uh, Lady Deathstrike. So if I bring in Lady Deathstrike, she could take that Doom, too. But Hulkling is already going to handle those two. And Lady Deathstrike can't take either of these, so I'm going to probably have to leave that alone. Corvus has the advantage of being able to take both um, infamous Iron Man, and he could take that... Um, 
bishop. So if I did that, we'd have Hulkling, we'd have Corvus, and uh, we've got, um, we can't bring Cosmic Ghost Rider because he wouldn't be able to take that bishop because of the node, the uh, energy. So we will bring in Corvus, which means we just need somebody for that super scroll. So I'm going to take a look uh, at the um, my options, and we'll go in with somebody that can uh, deal with this since they banned uh, Bishop. All right, let's get to the fighting. All right, so I did decide to go in with Cosmic Ghost Rider instead of Corvus. We also got Hulkling, of course, and Claire. So it's a little funny that I just ascended Corvus for this purpose, for war. And then I decided to go in with uh, Cosmic Ghost Rider, who's only rank four and not ascended. Go figure. Uh, but I wanted to play around with him and see if he could also um, do it, which I was pretty sure he could, but you never know. All right, so anyway, this first one is uh, Future Ant-Man. Now, I thought about bringing in uh, Gallon after I made the uh, uh, the intro video here, but fighting him with Gallon will take a little bit longer. So instead, I went in with Hulkling. Now, if you don't know about Hulkling, you only need to get a Pierce. All right, see, I got three Pierce right now. I don't have to worry about the glancing now, okay? Now, of course, he doesn't have an armor up or whatever, but as long as I can keep the, that uh, pierce up, no have to worry about the uh, glancing, all right? And right now, I'm just trying to set him up, all right? See, here we go. It did say glancing, but I was still doing damage. The problem with me being able to set him up the way I really want to is the power lock. That is annoying because Hulkling is not immune to power lock. But it's all good. Doesn't really matter. Look at Hulkling's health. And we're going to hit him with a special three, which he cannot glance. Oh, oh, oh. That just looked nasty. Painful. And down he goes. So not a really big deal. If I had used Gallon, the fight would have taken longer. I would have had to probably cycle at least three specials because you can't just nuke him like you can with uh most anybody else uh the damage is capped so you have to hit him with a special then you build up to another harvest hit him with a special another harvest and it just takes longer all right now doom is just annoying okay he is a tough defender anyway he doesn't benefit from this node and so I was like, you know what? I'm going in with Hulkling again because Hulkling is shock immune. He's not incinerate immune, as you can see here. And I'm like, are you kidding me? Do you know how many times this happens in war? It's really annoying, okay? Look at this, he's just pounding on me. All right, so I'm like, okay, let's just finish him off. It's really annoying because almost everywhere else I can block the first part of that special you know or I should say block the first part of the last part of the special so I can evade evade and then block and evade okay if that makes any sense but apparently in war they put glue on your feet when you try that. So I'll evade, I'll evade, and then I'll try to block evade. It won't evade. I'll just stop blocking. And that's why I end up getting hit. When you see that happen, that's why. Because I'm not blocking. I told it to evade, and it didn't. And now I'm not blocking. So it just drops my input. All right, so anyway, 
this this fight here i was interested to see now i thought and i forgot but i thought that he was a villain but he's not infamous iron man is not a villain i keep thinking doom you know but look at this look at this nasty he's not even rank five or ascended so he's bleed immune so he's great on that node and if the person can be armor broken forget about it i wonder how well he will do against like viv vision as well the thing about corvus corvus rocks okay um in alliance war especially but sometimes he can be a little dicey to play especially if you end up using up your um charges all right so you can see that i got the pre-fights of odin on this fight and i was worried about this fight because i wasn't sure if claire could do it claire is an attacker um uh, she benefits from the attacker tactic. I'm not sure how you even say that. Uh, and this was a global defender, right? So I'm like, I believe she can easily keep his um, buffs down because she's not shock immune and he does get armor ups. So I said, all right, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to get that uh, power start, advanced power boost, and let's see how that goes. All right. My idea here is to keep him down. So here we go. We're going in. I'm already at a special two. Fire it off. He's now immune to those buffs. Look at that health just disappearing. All right. Nope. No indestructible. Don't care. Parry. Keep going. Look at this. Back to a special two. And he's done. I worried about the fight for no reason. Easy. Easy. So you already know who's coming in anytime I see that super scroll. All right. So anyway, that's going to do it for my participation in this particular war. And we'll be back in a little bit and you'll find out how this war ended. And we're back. And unfortunately, we lost this war, as you can see here. But it's all good. Win some, you lose some here. Uh, shout out to our MVPs here. Uh, I will say this. One thing that is great that Kabam did in this meta, and I know a lot of people hate it, but maybe it was a slick way to take the stress off by making it so horrible that people just said, you know what? Forget this. We're not going to really stress ourselves over trying to push and be competitive. Maybe maybe that's what they're doing. I don't know. Um, but that is the effect that it's had. Many of the master alliances are like, Shh, not even going to push. And then you have some that were going to. They got messed over by a bug that has been a whole month and nothing done about it. But that's a whole nother topic. Anyway. That is going to do it for the video. Thank you all for watching. Take care. Hit the like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day.